So the first thing that I have coming up for you, um, Aries, is today, Wednesday. And what we're talking about here is the potential, not a guarantee, but the potential for money to go out the window, for repairs to be needed, for some kind of drama to be going on with things that you own, things that you're responsible for caretaking over. This could be your children. A lot of it, though, felt more mechanical to me or work-related. So especially for those of you that are homeowners, business owners, you may find um, that whether to your vehicles or the property itself, the machinery, whatever it is, that there are some repairs that need to be made. And I really don't get the impression that you have a choice it does feel that it, you're, it's the type of thing where you're going to have to step up and get it out of the way or other things are not going to function and the problem could become bigger. You may have anywhere from three days to three weeks to resolve this issue, but not much beyond that, okay? The other thing that I'm getting for you guys is paternal energy, or I want to say dad energy, coming in on Thursday as well as Friday. Now, this father energy, this paternal energy is referring to your love life very specifically. I don't think that we're talking about other love relationships as much as we are talking romantic and quite possibly something from your past or something that you have already started. It's already around in some way. So whether this be literal or this be more emotional you know, memories, thoughts being provoked. There is some type of a situation where living or deceased, your fathers, grandfathers, stepfathers, anyone, even mentors, paternal energy in your life is coming to communicate with you either from the grave or literally in your life. And it could also be memories of things that they said to you, but they're giving you a little bit of an I told you so. And what that's going to mean is that there was some type of instruction that you did not follow and at this point you might be really having to step up to the plate and communicate something over to someone else or resolve it within yourself if you got tied up in a relationship and you really shouldn't have well okay you may have to clear it out of your energy field for those of you that are feeling a bit trapped in something we do have a class called Relationships, Boundaries, and Cord Cutting up on the website. There's also talk here, Saturday the 8th, Sunday the 9th, of daughters, uh, female energies in your life. They don't have to literally be females. They could just be people in your life that are more um, feminine. And it could even be sisters or friends, but it seems to be someone either younger than you or someone in a more immature status or position or their mentality, their personality and character is a little bit more youthful. I feel a need for you to talk things out with this person. It seems to me that in this relationship or this situation in your life, you kind of vibrate high and fast and powerful right, as Aries tend to do, and maybe just sort of plow this person over a little bit because they tend to be more mindful and they uh, think before they talk and uh, the situation has been a bit slower or required more patience, but they are coming with a loving heart. So whether this is a situation or it's literally a person, it may even be a group. For some of you, the fact that they're coming to the table with an open, loving heart and they are looking for this communication, I feel that you really need to do it. And then we have uh, Wednesday the 12th and going into next week for approximately three days, travel. Uh, it almost feels to me like rerouting or commuting. There's some examination on where you're going and where you're headed. And I feel good about it. A ton of energy with that. Don't make hasty decisions, but do go where you need to go right now to find those answers. Okay, good luck with your week, Aries.